A Miami woman was fast asleep on her couch when an unusually creepy looking woman decides to enter her home. Captured on the homeowner's canary home security system, this stranger was filmed the entire time she rummaged through this house. Even more odd is how this woman hovers over the homeowner on the couch, watching her sleep. I originally thought this video was fake because the stranger looks like the possessed girl in your typical scary movie, but the incident is 100% real and most likely wouldn't be believed without this footage. This individual was never caught or identified. A Reddit user named Necromimi posted the CCTV of a ghost captured at her friend's home. A translucent figure walks back and forth from one side of the room to the other multiple times often fading from sight about midway across and reappearing a few feet away. After a while, it becomes slower and moves in place, eventually fading away into an orb that floats up towards the camera and disappears. The remarkable timing of this event rules out any possibility of a glitch, which makes me suspect that this was either some clever editing or truly paranormal. A YouTube channel called Mux9TV goes exploring some extra scary woods in Pakistan late at night when they find some really creepy stuff that leaves them really freaked out. Out of the woods staggers a mysterious figure who refuses to speak for a long time. His eyes look haunting, like he's seen too much in too short a time and has been wandering for days, unable to get it out of his mind. The group does not know how else to help this person, and so they recite some words of faith over him, which works to the extent of scaring him away back to wherever he came from. This doesn't look like a ghost sighting, so much as the aftermath of a person who has had a paranormal experience of their own in the forest and has succumbed to madness in the days since. Either way, they're definitely not the type of person you'd want to encounter in the woods, so I bet the group is relieved when he runs away, but at the same time, he could probably use some help. Hopefully, he finds peace, but with that scary stare, I don't see how such a thing is going to be possible. A team of ghost hunters are using a modified Kinect camera to capture paranormal presence in the historic Houghton Mansion in North Adams, Massachusetts. It was once owned by a wealthy businessman, but has since been converted to a Masonic temple and is believed to be haunted by otherworldly spirits. The person in green is one of the hunters, but listen to what they hear. What was that? Yeah, what was that? I was walking. No, 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 no it was the voice. voice. The voice. Yeah, that was a girl's voice. Yeah. Girl's voice. Absolutely a girl's voice. Oh, you can really hear the voice when you put headphones on. Anyway, I think this video is real because in fake videos, they tend to talk one at a time and not all at once. But in this video, everybody convincingly talks over each other and reacts with genuine surprise. I'd like to hear what you think though. The news is pretty boring until something totally unexpected like this happens and you'll never guess what it is. Two anchors are having a chat when their background gets bizarre. Well, it, it really nice. I've been very lucky because I've looked after by a, a fantastic medical team, fantastic consultants and nurses. Ordinarily, I would say this is two different shots edited together. However, the crowd seems to stay the same as the man disappears. At 4 seconds, you can see the individual is crossing from left to right. They come out from the column soon after the man disappears, which indicates this was all one continuous take. An urban exploration channel called JJ Retro is exploring an abandoned house on the edge of an English village late at night. You can tell he's nervous just standing at the entrance of this creepy estate. Time to come exploring somewhere like this because we're in the middle of nowhere, um, on the outskirts of Slinfold at this rather creepy house, and uh, there's a sort of haunted feel to it. Outside, they find a spooky tree with a rope slung over the branch and a plank of wood to step off of. I don't think we need to spend much time explaining what kind of scary events happened here, and when they start exploring the inside, every room fills them with a renewed sense of dread. Yeah, this, this is creepy. This is probably the creepiest building we've done so far in our urban exploring Career. Oh. 
They try to joke their way out of how scary this urban exploration is, but eventually they have to admit they are getting spooked by something paranormal in the house with them. Weird noises are coming from upstairs, or so they say, but to be honest, I don't hear anything. Jen, what the f is that noise? It's quite about the stairs. But as they slowly creep up the stairs, I can actually hear the weird sound, and that's when they get it. The creepy encounter caught on camera that they were all looking for. Very good chin. Oh, f***ing this around. No. Hello? And that's when, with all of them on the steps, mind you, the urban explorers see a rocking chair moving on its own. Come on. <laughs> and that was the haunted house here in Slimfog and with. Since part of the chair is hidden by the doorway, maybe somebody was off camera making the chair move. Otherwise, this place is definitely haunted. A YouTuber named Furious Otter is piloting his nosy drone across a long stretch of woods when he comes across a mysterious all white object that doesn't match the native scenery. He grows curious and decides to take the drone closer to the ground to get a better look. It's a decision that he probably now regrets. It doesn't look like much at first, but the situation becomes much more clear after he zooms in. A witch-like figure appears to crouch low while watching the drone from the tree line. I can't tell if they are waving at them or brushing something out of their hair, but either way, this strange hermit just shouldn't be out here this deep in the woods. This video is terrifying if it's real, but a couple of things make me question its authenticity. I know drones can get a lot closer than that, so why didn't he try to get closer to see if they needed help instead of immediately flying away? I guess he could have been worried about losing his drone, or possibly even getting cursed, so he just got out of there fast instead. If that's the case, then I can't say I blame him. Let me know what you think you would have done if you were there. There is more to fear in the woods. Published to YouTube in October of 2007 by Dennis Daunt. This video purports to show paranormal activity in the forest outside of Dudley Town. In the forest, a man is heard dialing up a friend to let him know that he's seeing some creature in the forest again, and he's going to try and catch it on video. He runs upstairs from the sound of it to catch it from a better vantage point. That's when, faintly, at the forest's edge, you can see a shadow pass in front of the trees in a quick flick. Some in the comments think it's a horse, but according to many others, Dudley Town is a cursed place. YouTuber TopSex4 warns others, Stay out of Dudley Town, it's a dangerous and evil place. When you get into the town, there is no sound, not even a bird, it's like you're in a vacuum. Bad things happen here. DGS104 also claims that his friend's car was trashed by spirits there. While well, Dave Harley agrees that Dudley Town is absolutely no joke, adding that many are said to have passed away in the coal mines, while other residents simply went insane. With such accounts and this video, I'm convinced to never visit. This footage was reportedly taken on a flight somewhere over Zambia. A person is casually recording out their window when a giant humanoid creature starts to materialize in the distance. The creature seems to keep pace and ride alongside them for a moment before disengaging and twisting away. The obvious answer to this is CGI. If it's not CGI, however, then what this creature could be is anyone's guess. This trail camera captures some deer grazing when one of them pauses as if something is nearby. They look directly at the camera, and in that moment, a phantom pair of eyes move in the opposite direction. I was thinking that this could be a camera glitch that somehow reflects the deer's eyes back at an angle, but the eyes can be seen briefly again at the 
12 second mark. And this time it looks like the deer notices and stares directly at them with more curiosity than fear. There are also plenty of other movements where the deer is looking at the camera without the phantom eyes present, so it might not be the equipment after all. Could this be an unknown flying creature like the uploader seems to think? Some cultures believe that the forest itself develops a living spirit to watch over the creatures within, so maybe that is what we are all witnessing here. Someone's always gotta ruin the party. Posted to TikTok by Suntu Kajasi. This group took a bunch of photos at a waterfall in Indonesia, but one pic turned out much creepier than the rest. As the group poses before this beautiful falls, a black robe figure is spotted, lurking in the background. You cannot see its face, but it seems to be watching them. What is this figure doing? And did it lose their life in these falls? I guess we're left with more questions than answers for this one. What are these strange so-called light balls that keep setting this Redditor's cameras off? Redditor Spambone is wondering if the Reddit community has any theories. Well, let's see what we can come up with as well. Let's take a look. This goes on for two minutes. Sometimes two light balls appear simultaneously. Some say it's obviously a bug. Others think it's a web of some kind. Still others say it's a laser pointer or a reflection of some other light source. Practically, no one thinks this is an orb or paranormal in any way. And neither do I. I'm firmly in the spider or cobweb camp. What do you think it is? A paranormal crew communicated with numerous unearthly entities in this haunted place. Published by Paranormal Voyages in January of 2022, the crew first records a disembodied voice that they don't seem to hear in the moment. Yeah. <laughs> A moment later, while they're communicating through the spirit box, something appears over one of their shoulders. They then hear what sounds like a scream. Oh, that was disembodied. That it was not like it was to me. It's a scream. The spirits tell one of the crew to move forward. Something's telling me for you to move forward a little more. Oh, what? Whoa, what the heck is that? Hear that? Whoa. Oh. I want to move forward. Later, while using a Kinect, an anomaly is detected. After being bombarded with questions, the spirits have a question for the crew. But why? Oh. No, no, no. Oh, no. my. Did you hear that whisper? But why? But why? They asked for a baby, yeah. and we said no, and it goes, but why? While they continue to communicate, one of the crew feels a sharp pain in his heart. What? Jeez. My heart just started hurting. You know what? Yeah, I think. <laughs> that was like a sharp pain. Back with the Kinect, another anomaly makes its presence known. What do all these spirits want with the living? Maybe if we listen closely, we'll hear it. Did this YouTuber capture skinwalkers in a screaming match? While wandering through Gila National Forest, mysterious wailing echoed all around him. It's very nice. As the cameraman stood waiting, he heard the screams again. They were so terrifying, they spun him around. And again. But where is it coming from? And to whom does this wailing belong? Skinwalkers? Or something else entirely? I think I'm going to stay far away from that forest. This video could very well be proof that the humanoid kingdom extends into the insect world. 
At first glance, this video appears to be a firefly or some similar sort of bug, but when slowed down frame by frame, you can clearly see that this is not a bug at all but rather appears to be a tiny winged humanoid. The video shows an insect-like humanoid with clearly discernible arms and legs. Unlike most bugs, this humanoid only has four limbs, and the arms appear to be twice as short as the legs, much like a person. There's simply no insect on Earth like it. It's just too bad the lighting conditions don't provide more detail, because it would have been interesting to see more of its face and overall color patterns. Exactly where this video was shot is not known. A man pulls over and records a video with his camera. After hearing a loud screaming that sounded like an animal in distress, or possibly even a person, that's when another horrifying scream comes from the woods. I'm gonna go check it out. Jumping around is a yelling humanoid creature that grows quiet and disappears in the tall reeds when it sees it's caught on camera. The man runs to his car and later suspects it could be a rake sighting caught on tape. The noises it makes are disturbing and do kind of sound like other rake sighting videos, so maybe he's right. Here is a still photo of the unknown creature, sighting taken at 23 seconds, just before it ducks down. Its arms look abnormally long and it's very broad-shouldered too. What do you think? Is this a person or a monster? I'm afraid he could have spotted the rake after all. A YouTuber in India named Fayaz, the Mizhan, travels to the Kalapali Cemetery at midnight, where a humanoid shadow figure is said to haunt anyone foolish enough to come near. This is the exact moment he accidentally caught a ghost on camera, as his viewers would later point out to him. Something hangs back to watch him under the street lamps. Something strange. You can just barely see the shadow moving away if you watch down by its legs. Considering the infamous haunted graveyard is directly beside him, I think it stands to reason that the shadow is paranormal. Todd T captures a large humanoid looking figure going down his neighbor's chimney. He's too far away to pick up any discernible details, but the creature looks to be far too large to be a bird or pretty much any other animal. Whatever this is, it looks to be the size of a human. The mysterious creature stuffs itself down the chimney in less than a minute, at which point I'm guessing it roams around the interior of the home for whatever it can find. What happened to Todd's neighbor is anyone's guess. This London poltergeist is extremely aggressive. Captured at around 4 in the morning, YouTube channel The London Paranormal One shares this unbelievable footage. First, you just hear unexplained sounds off screen. But then, it begins. And if that wasn't enough, this happens. The poltergeist sure likes making a mess. Either that or one of the fridge magnets is possessed, as YouTuber Flapzapple suggests. But that leads to a bigger question. Which one? This rocket ride is a famous local attraction at the Luna Park in St. Petersburg, Russia. Here's what the ride looks like normally. And this is what it looks like after a cable frays to the point of snapping clean through. This angle clearly shows how close the riders are to plummeting hundreds of feet below. Look at the top of the ride. That cable to the left is the only thing keeping them alive. The tip of the ride is bending from the pressure and looks ready to come off. Rescue workers are eventually able to get everyone down to safety, though I'm not sure they felt anything but safe while dangling over 200 feet in the air with no end in sight. Thank you so much for getting me to 50,000 subscribers here on my Clips channel. If you want to support, please press that subscribe button. Let's get to 60,000 subscribers next. Thank you.